Hello everyone, I'm your host, your SCP host, Skills to Play, and today's build, well, I'm a little late, um, two days late to this one, this is on the pre-staging branch, by the way, uh, cause I didn't know if you guys wanted me to cover it or not, so I did the poll, and you guys wanted me to, so, oh, excuse me, anyways, uh, so I'm a bit late to this, but now, whenever there's a new build in the pre-staging beta, I will cover that. <coughs> My goodness. Drinking Sprite does wonders to a man. Anyways, uh, so let's get into it. So first up, they completely reworked uh, first person flashes to make them look nicer. Um, the third person effects are work in progress and are temporarily disabled. So let's take a look. By the way, you might not have known this, but you can hold down um, left or right click on a grenade and you can you know, hold it, and you don't just have to click it immediately, so, yeah, yeet. That looks basically the same, but who knows? Uh, let's try chucking it down the hallway, yeet! Oh yeah, that, yeah, that is different, okay. Yeah, I can see that, alright. Next up, they slightly adjusted 079's effects. Um, even though I am on the, I have his post processing disabled, so I'm not sure how they're gonna be different. Uh, ah, maybe that looks like they're less intense, but that just might be my thing. But yeah, so that's different. They reworked the muting system, so let's see. Player management. Here we go. So I'm I'm a muted. Unfortunate. Well, the reworked how it works, so yeah. I'll have to look into that a bit further. Uh, weapon status is now synced in third person models, so that means other players can see if the weapon is unloaded, cocked, or out of ammo, which is nice. Um, the revolver cocking sound will now play, or will be audible to other people, so let's, you know, uh, repressor. So this sound, not that one, this one. Is now audible. There is now ammo prediction system in place for the firearms, which should reduce the amount of visual glitches on high ping servers. So there's it's gonna be more consistent with different things. Moving on to some bug fixes. They fixed various issues with weapon scopes and 939 vision. So let's uh I have the telescopic site right here. Let us see what it looks like, cause you y'all know how I remember, or y'all remember what it looked like before, right? Well, ooh, that's a lot better. That's so much smoother, and just that that looks so much better. Okay, ooh, nice, looks good. And uh, you know what I think it looks like? This. I think there was some like weird issues with it or something. I don't. I never saw any problems with it, but if there was, okay. It. They fixed a visual bug relating to HP and stamina sliders being visible right after joining a server. So, yeah, it's that, that weird glitch where like appear and then you go away. And yeah, you know what I mean. They fixed the ticket fetch command, not requiring any perms, so you can't see the tickets if you don't have perms. So, yeah. Uh, they fixed players being able to pick up 018 immediately after its activation. So you can no longer pick it up when you throw it. And they fix a soft lock issue, or they fix the soft lock caused by the disarming system. And yeah, that is the build from two days ago. So I'll mark it two days ago. Uh, so if, just so it's consistent. But yeah, I'll see you guys later. I hope you guys have a good day. Goodbye.